A question of character. Hetty is the most courageous puppet to ever exist. But does Hetty have a neck? Yes. No, you don't. But he does have heart and head, obviously. It is a weapon. Super head attack. The treasure theater show. It is under attack. Dark Demon looks to evilize the puppets while maintaining a positive attitude. Poor Smiley. He disposes of the puppet trash, including Hetty. But Hetty does not consider himself trash. Hetty is the hero. It, it says, says right here on the sign. Hetty is off. Destroy Robo Collector. Face evil. Trouble brewing. Dark Demon's trusted hench puppet cat who was easily surprised. I cannot believe it. Believe it, puppet cat. You've been beaten by my head. It is Hetty's main attack. It is Hetty's only attack. Hetty does not punch. Hetty does not kick. Only weaponized head butts. Headcase is Hetty's friend. Headcase provides cranial weaponry. Super head, slammer head, empty head, liberty head, shoot it, pig head, sleepy head, lots of head, pin head, Hetty is tiny, he dodges, spike, vacuum head, suck those points, super, oh, I already said that one, ticker head, time freezes, death continues, bomb head, head trip, Y head case, and Hetty's normal head, it's good too, Hetty does not fight for money, he detests capitalism, he'll hit you with his head, Hetty is a tactical genius, In Incorporating the laws of physics to proceed. Genius. He uses the bizarre treasure theater show to his advantage. Twisting set pieces. Exposing lazy gaffers. As well, Hetty flies. They tell him to don't fly. But Hetty is going to yes fly. Morphing his head into a bird that shoots out little birds. Or a biplane. Or a lasered shuttle. Battleship number six has little chance against Hetty's on slot of tiny birds. Hetty looks of a bird, a decapitated bird with floating head power. Hetty's head is made of hard plastic. Atop it is a feather that is not a wing, but changes upon Hetty's emotion. Hetty questions. His body is made of soft cloth, a nifty bow tie, displaying his health via the color on its button and tennis shoes, allowing Hetty to make dangerous leaps. But Hetty's friends allow him to do even more. Hangman. Hetty grasps his lips around Hangman's circular waist. Hangman does not mind. Use my body to your advantage, Hetty, as well. Another friend provides Hetty with priceless intel. Bo. Bo finds the weak points. No secret is safe from Bo. Bo risks his life for the intel and cries in fear. <coughs> or cries because Hetty hit him. <coughs> Speaking of hit, Hetty possesses efficient puppet life force, gauged by a polychromatic spotlight. Upon reaching red, Hetty's head explodes, his body flailing until reaching the underworld. Lastly, Hetty is enamored from the mysterious but incredibly beautiful Heather. Using the powers of floating hands, Heather assists by obtaining the key master's keys, but is sometimes captured. Hetty will save her. Hetty will save all. Do not cry. Cry, Miss Daisy. Do not worriedly sway, Mr. Porter. Hetty is here. Power. Excellent. Hetty is only as powerful as what's in his head. Literally. So luckily, he can process thought and bash at the same time. Defense. Excellent. Hetty has a heart of steel, but a body of cloth. However, it is tough cloth as well. Any injury can be healed through delicious jelly beans. The highest form of nutrition for a puppet. Agility. Excellent. Teddy is not bound by strings, thank God. Therefore, he is able to jump and maneuver even while miniature. And Hangman is there, offering his body for Hetty's mouth. Uh, grade A. Although Hetty is only 12 years old, in puppet years, this is the lifetime of a man. A man that hates evil. A man that loves good. A man that tries his best to manage his massive headache. The strong man pose. Next episode. A force is a force, of course, of course. Quest with me. Learn with us. Enrich your mind. Empower your inquiry. Like our material. Subscribe to our page. Put character into quest. Return every Monday for more. A question of character.